Well, here we are, back again with the classic 350 with the modifications. Uh, I, I, um, I'm fed up of making videos about these modifications, and I expect you're fed up of looking at them. Everybody's got their own idea about it, um, and I can only tell you my thoughts. All right, let's go back a little bit to last week. It's still got the modifications on, and I've been working down in Southampton. And I rode this bike down there, all around the M25 and down the M3, and back again at the end of the week. And um, like I say, it's 190 miles each way, and uh, it's a fair old test for it, really, isn't it? So, how did it perform? Well, it ate fuel, that's for sure. That's the first thing I'll say. With the, all the modifications on, it eats fuel. Uh, I could get 200 miles to a tank full easily out of this bike, was a standard bike. And now I'm down to about 130, maybe 140. But it all depends how you're riding it. So let's deal with the modifications <coughs> as they stand, right? Let's talk about the cam. Now, this if you want to wring this the nads out of this little bike up to almost up to the rev limiter, then yes, you will notice the difference with the cam. It's a little bit more lively. But the mid-range has gone down a, a bit. I don't think it's as uh, good in the mid-range as, as a factory bike, a stock bike. Um, but I didn't buy this little bike to ride it like that. I don't want to ride it like that. That's not, not what I bought it for. Um, it won't hold 70 uphills against a headwind it won't hold 70 against a slight headwind anyway with this with these modifications on so i think the cam yes it does the job but up at the higher revs and, and if you've bought the bike to do that i think you've bought the wrong bike um fuel x light right okay it's supposed to make the engine run cooler right okay well what's happened here then exhaust pipes as blue as a blue thing and uh, after a run, you pull in the motorway services to get fuel or something like that. You put your hand on the cases and it'll burn you just the same as a standard one. It's just as hot. So I think the Fuel X Light is rubbish, to be quite honest with you. Um, I don't put the fuel consumption down to just the cam, I reckon the Fuel X Light as well. Anything that makes it richer is going to use more fuel than them. But do you get an extra performance out of it for having that uh, having that amount of fuel going in? Pfft, no, I don't think so. And I'm having issues with it now of starting and stalling at low revs. Um, I think, I haven't looked yet, but I'll take the lambda sensor out of the exhaust here, which is here, and uh, see if it's all sooty. I expect it is because looking at the exhaust pipe, which used to run nice and clean, it's pretty black, pretty black in there. It's doing something with that fuel. So that's, I don't think the fuel X light is a lot of good to be quite honest with you. The DNA filter, it's all right if you like listening to that howling row all the time. It's, uh, it's noisy. Um, I'm going to take all these modifications off this bike because it was a much nicer bike when it was standard. I'm so, if you've done all the modifications and you're really happy with your bike, I'm very happy for you. But for me, no. Not, it's not, it's, it's, it's spoiled the bike and I've said that in a previous video. It has spoiled the bike. And I know you want to hear all good things about these bikes, but if you want to hear the truth, I'll tell you the truth. I can only speak as I find on one of my bikes on my channel. So I'll say what I like. <laughs> Sorry about that, but I will. You know, it's... Has it improved the bike? No, I can't see in any way it has improved the bike. It won't go any faster. It still hits the rev limit, if you, if you want to. But I don't want to ride it like that. That's not what I bought the bike for originally. So, and um, Hitchcock's stainless steel pipe and the D-cat 
and all the rest of it. Can't see any. I can jump from this one onto the red one, and I can't really notice the difference riding like I normally ride. Really can't notice the difference. Only if you wring this one out, really rev it hard through every gear, will you notice the difference. So, is it worth the money? I mean, you're looking at probably best part of 800 pound, aren't you, to, to, to put all these bits on it. Um, I didn't, I didn't, I oh, sorry, I didn't put the, bit, the bits and pieces on it, the mods on it. Um, I like said in a previous video, I bought this bike brand new, uh, decided to let one of them go, because I've got two of them. And uh, this one went to the Norfolk Thunderbolt, and he put all the parts on. And um, then he decided that he wanted a, a 500 bullet, and I already had a deal with him over his 500 bullet, so he had his 500 bullet back, and I had this little classic back. So I'm now the third, the first and the third owner of this little bike. But um, has it come back a better bike? No, no it hasn't, I'm sorry. So, there we are, I'm, um, like I say, I know, I know you only want to hear good things, I know you do. So, you know, you can dislike this video all you like, I don't care, I'm not bothered. It doesn't make any difference to me whether you dislike it or not. So, um, oh, I'm not happy with it. Um, I'm just not happy with it now. So I'm going to take all the bits off and then I will be happy, won't I? It'll be back to a standard bike. Um, I mean, it's got a, it's got a, a baffle in it. But it's still... pretty noisy. And I'll tell you what, on a long ride, it gets on your wick. Just listening to it. It just... it's, it's like, you know, especially at the revs it's doing. I've got a 16 tooth gearbox sprocket which is not on it. I put that on it when, it, when I first got it as standard. But it wouldn't hold its speed on into a headwind on the motorways and I took it, well, I went back to standard gearing. Um, I haven't even bothered putting it on, it on here. Because it won't, it, you, you won't be able to rev it hard enough with the higher gear to be able, the cam to, to be able to do its stuff. Um, so this is only my opinions and they're like a-holes and they? everybody's got one and this is just mine this is just my opinion on this bike which is mine <laughs> you know and i can say what i like with it but it's not as good as it was when i bought it brand new still looks nice though doesn't it that screen it just pops at you in the, in the sunshine i don't know if you can see that sparkly in there you might not pick it up the camera but it's really sparkly it's like a metal flake very fine metal flake but uh it was a sunny day when i bought it from the dealers and they pushed it out onto the pavement and it was a sunny day like this and it just popped at me and i thought look at that look, i'm gonna have to have that one so, <laughs> so there we are all's not lost i've got all the standard parts it all came back with the standard parts i'll put them all back on and i'll just enjoy the bike how it is we'll have the fuel consumption back again nice and quiet um and a lot more enjoyable to ride i think you may disagree with me and you, you're entitled to do that i don't care it doesn't make any difference to me i'm talking about my bike and what I don't like about it now. And all the mods are going to come off, so. Uh, I, you know, you're going to still have, make, have to make your own mind up where you think it's worth it. I can't, I can't make your own mind up for you, can I? It's just my opinion on my bike with these mods on. Nothing more, nothing less. It doesn't suit me, it may suit you. So, whatever you do, enjoy yourself enjoy your bikes however you've got them tuned or not tuned um, but I, I'm going to turn this back to a standard bike so there we are I've said my bit now go ahead and dislike and do what you like <laughs> and put some nasty comments if you like I don't mind I don't care so anyway that's it I can't say any more about it um, 
some cats were here a minute ago. I don't think I've picked them up on the video. I don't know where they're gone. Anyway, all right, I'll see you on the next one anyway. Bye-bye.